It's currently 5.40 a.m. And, uh, and I'm up for work. Um, probably gonna take a dump, uh, eat breakfast and shower, and then get ready for work. So yeah. Breakfast is not that great. It's pretty small, but I mean, it's kind of expected. And uh, I got the fit. Yeah, so here, got me some work boots, some nice steel toed shoes, some jeans, and then uh, a collared shirt. I don't know if you really have to wear a long sleeve collared shirt or just like any collared shirt, or honestly just a t-shirt, but uh, we're just gonna wear this just because of you know, first impressions. I don't know. So yeah, um, I feel like I'm, I'm a construction worker in this, so, uh, you know. Um, next is 6.53. Um, probably go to the gas station, gas station across the street, get some breakfast, and then I'll probably make my way to uh, work, where uh, I guess I'll just see what's happening. All right, bye, buddy. What's up, everybody? We just got done with our first day as a field engineer. Um, it's a lot longer than I expected. So uh, I got there at 7.30, or I started at 7.30, and uh, I, I got done at 5, about 5.45. And yeah, so it was about a little over 10 hours. Um, I wasn't doing much but sitting in the office because I was just doing training stuff. Um, but yeah, uh, drove past some windmills. It's pretty cool, actually. Um, other than that, uh, the people who work there, um, they're all pretty cool. Uh, most of them seem pretty normal. But anyways, yeah, this is my first day. Uh, hopefully, I can keep this up for at least two more years. Hi everybody, um, just got done day two. I forgot to record earlier, so it's currently a little past 10. Uh, my bedtime's coming up soon. It was a long day again, but um, it was a lot more fun than yesterday. I was just doing paperwork. I actually got to do some field work, so that was good. Another thing that we did that was actually really fun is me and my civil group, uh, which is um, about eight people. We went out to get uh, dinner at the steakhouse called Rusty Ducks. Maybe I'll put it right there. I, I don't know if I feel like it, but yeah, um, we like we got to uh, order uh, a bunch of steaks. I got a ribeye that was cooked in wine and butter sauce. It cost forty dollars, so of course, oh, delicious! Um, I was able to eat half of it, and then the other half is just sitting in my fridge. So yeah, but that was on company card. Oh, thank the Lord. But yeah, that was a, it's a good dinner. Um, if you guys ever happen to be in Dexter, Iowa, okay, I'll put that there. Okay, you see it? Yeah, T check out the Rusty Duck because their steaks are pretty good. If you, eh, it's a little expensive, but I think it's really, it's, it's honestly worth the money um, if you're feeling in a, a nice date mood. But yeah, um, other than that, the day was pretty, pretty long, hot. You know, just the usual what you're doing at construction site. I'm also excited to kind of hang out with the people, get to know them more. Cause you know, that's, you know, they're probably gonna be my only friends for the next six months while I'm here. Uh, four weeks, I'm going on rotation. So I think whatever the weekend of August 6th, 
I'm going on rotation, which means I have a four day weekend. Please give me uh, ideas of where to go. Uh, probably places where either, you know, someone is able to pick me up or is relatively cheap for Ubers or Lyfts. Cause um, my first rotation, I'm honestly trying to go somewhere, you know, somewhere nice, a big city, you know, just try food. Um, you know, hopefully have the money, hopefully my paycheck starts stacking up and I don't spend too much. I've been talking to some of my coworkers and I think they might be giving me some, or renting out a room in their place. So <clears throat> hopefully I get one of that and start saving about $2,000 a month. Hopefully if I am able to do that, I got an extra $2,000 to spend. And I don't know where I'm going to use that money for. But yeah, um, anyways, it's just day two. First week, you know, it's going, it's a little long, but you know, I'm making it through. I don't think anything's too bad. Um, tomorrow, I'm going to get videos of me suited up in my construction stuff. And I'm going to show y'all what I look like. But yeah, anyways, um... I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey everybody, um, just finished my third day. Uh, today was pretty slow. I think we're just waiting on the workers to do their part before we can continue on to the next part. So yeah, didn't really do much. I'm now back at my hotel. I went grocery shopping. We got fruit snacks, chips, some, you know, I don't know. Oh no. And um, and we got a nice microwave dinner, fajitable. Currently, I am finishing up my leftover steak from the rusty duck. Here we got it. We got that nice medium rare. It's been microwaved and since some homemade fries. And of course, you see this, it may look like metal, but it's actually the stupid party silver plastic wares that I bought because I didn't know where else to get uh, so utensils and the only place here is Dollar General and I guess Dollar General doesn't have regular utensils. So yeah, you can see it right here. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a box to put crap in. So it's easier to move, but yeah. Um, pretty slow day, didn't do much. Drove around in the car. Up, drop off ice cream to uh, some of the workers. Hopefully I can go to sleep tonight and um, I'll see you guys tomorrow morning where there will be they're, they're bringing a, a food truck to make burritos for everybody. So yeah, that'll be nice. You know, get some free burritos before work. One thing I am worried about is having in one of those porta potties. They're, I have to take a piss in them, but it's they're disgusting. And like, I, you're out there in broad daylight, so you can see everything in them Porta Johns. Luckily, they have like little urinals, so when I go in there, I don't have to face that bowl, but sometimes it just catches my eye. And let's just say brown contrasts from blue very well. I'll see you guys tomorrow, and yeah, peace. Okay, what's up everybody? It's currently Saturday. I didn't record Thursday, Friday. Uh, I kind of forgot. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't really much. Just, you know, doing stuff. Not Nothing really too important. But yeah, anyways, um, so today is my first day off. I guess, I don't know. Usually I don't get Saturdays off, but um, I'm not doing anything, so I just didn't come in, I guess. Since this is my first day off, I decided to go to Des Moines, because, you know, there's not really much to do in a day, so if I'm not doing anything, I might as well go somewhere. So currently, I'm in Des Moines. I forgot to tell you guys at the uh, hotel, but got breakfast in a day. Food is pretty good. For the price, I think it was $15. It was way better than any IHOP. Don't, don't ever get breakfast at no IHOP. It's a, it's a waste of money, because I paid $15 for like bacon, uh, egg, sausage, ham, hash browns, pancakes. And there's like a big ass plate, three sausage, three bacons, a big slice of ham, three eggs, a whole little thing of hash browns. So much better than IHOP. Family Des Moines, uh, there's on um, Walmart's here. 
there's like a park so i'm gonna be checking those out just to see what i can do and you know if the morning's fun maybe every weekend i come here and do something so i'm not completely bored on the weekends but yeah hopefully you guys will be able to see some so i just got back from des moines um it's i would it's, I say Des Moines is basically like uh, kind of like South Tulsa. <clears throat> there's really not much to do. Um, there's a shopping mall. I went to the shopping mall. Just walked around for a little bit. Checked out everything. Um, you know, I don't really think malls are that fun. So I mean, it was whatever. I just had something to do. But I also had a large shopping center. So I checked out a bunch of places. Um, went to Nike, Dick's, where I got this new hat so I fit in better. <laughs> And um, yeah, and there's a, I kind of just went shopping around trying to look for uh, stuff to buy to keep me um, occupied on my days off because it was really boring today. Um, well, when I wasn't in um, Des Moines, at least. Des Moines also has like a little park. It was really nice. It was like a lake with like trails around it and everything. And at some point you'd see the uh, downtown area. Yeah, and I'll put a video um, that shows what it looks like right now. And yeah, other than the park, uh, I mean, the park was kind of hot today. <clears throat> well, honestly, it was like, it got to the 80s, but it was humid around that lake. Oh my god, I, I checked my back at one point and it was just covered in sweat and like nothing dried. So it was pretty gross, but I mean, it was nice. You can kayak, boat in the lake, fish. I didn't catch any fish, but I tried. Other than that, I kind of just drove around, checked out the uh, downtown area. And, you know, it's like a, it's like a whatever kind of city. It's not really big, not, not much you can do, but, um... Maybe uh, next weekend or the other, I'll uh, go check that out. Check out, go check out for like the food. I mean, you always find food everywhere. But this morning I ate that breakfast, so it's kind of like all the money I really want to spend going out to eat. Now I just gotta eat on my, uh, I think I have ham sandwiches with some lettuce, mustard, and mayo. This is the first weekend uh, in the middle of nowhere. Um, it's pretty boring, I'll say. But yeah, hopefully that uh, getting back to work, I start doing more stuff that keep me occupied. And you know, kind of, I don't know. And hopefully, I hang out with my team some more because honestly, it's pretty fun, especially when there's nobody else to hang out with. What's up, everybody? Um, so today's Sunday. Uh, I didn't really do much. I just got up, trying to figure out stuff that could download League of Legends. So that's a uh, that's disappointing, but yeah, I just need something to uh, fill in my time because it got really boring this uh, today. Um, but anyways, I realized that I'm really showing you guys the job site. The job site is about seven minutes away from my uh, hotel, so probably about halfway there. But anyways, um, yeah, I'll see you guys at the job site. Okay, guys, I'm currently at the site. Um, Here's just so we're next to a big ass wind turbine. So yeah, that's like right there. Um, then we got a bunch of other construction equipment. There's a bunch of company trucks. Some more construction crap. I don't know what half the stuff does. Um, yeah. This is kind of what it looks like. Over there we got kind of like the offices. Uh, that's where I'm at half the time. But it's uh, interesting stuff. So yeah, over here we got some fuel to re, uh, refuel the equipment. We just got a bunch of conics just everywhere full of, I don't even know. They just, yeah, full of whatever. Not the game, but it works on uh, Sunday, so this is kind of what everything looks like. Here are the offices with the site map and then those are the 
awful porta potties that I'm always scared of. So, yeah. This is a. Uh, so this is just what um you know this is just where I go to work just so you guys can see uh, pretty I mean nothing too cool about it hopefully I get to drive some of the uh, equipment like a bulldozer or an excavator just got you know befriend the uh, the operators so yeah it'll probably be a couple weeks before um, you see me driving in uh, an excavator. But, you know, it's pretty fun when you're at a construction site. Definitely a different vibe for me. I say it's kind of cool. Um, just getting thrown into something entirely different. I'll make a video for my next rotation. Or my first upcoming rotation. So, yeah, don't forget to give me ideas of where to go. Um, if I have the money. If not, maybe I just go home and uh, save it. Oh, yeah. I forgot. Uh, I'll show you guys the town I'm living in, so like the area, in a couple of seconds. Right where that speed limit sign is, you'll see everything. Okay. So yeah, pretty small town. Really, isn't much to do here. Just a uh, nice, uh, very quaint town small okay now we're kind of pushing to where I live we got a budget in a Casey's over there Casey's kind of got good food for a uh, gas station we got Dollar General come and go in the subway these are this is where I uh, usually go to eat and over there we got the chuck wagon which is a breakfast place and I think just burger place pretty good for the price I would recommend if you're ever in town and then we have this little shop that I also want to try um, but uh, I've been trying to spend money so I haven't eaten there yet but probably this upcoming week I'll eat there that's kind of what the town looks like officially my first seven days here my first week in Adair very interesting pretty boring but Hey, it's whatever. Um, yeah, bye.